Have you ever wondered about the origins of one of the most haunted houses in Britain? In the heart of Gloucestershire, nestled within the quaint town of Watton under Edge, stands a structure whose history is as fascinating as it is eerie. This is the tale of the ancient Ram Inn, a building dating back to the year 1145. Its original purpose was as noble as it was practical to house the laborers who toiled tirelessly on the construction of the nearby St. Mary's Church. But there's more to this story. You see, unbeknownst to many, this inn was erected on ancient pagan burial grounds, a detail that would come to define its legacy. This site, rich with history and steeped in mystery, was also at the intersection of ley lines. For those unfamiliar, ley lines are believed by many to be conduits for spiritual energy. These invisible paths crisscross the earth, and where they intersect, the energy is said to be amplified. Could it be this concentrated energy that has fueled the countless tales of the paranormal associated with the ancient Ram Inn? Some believe so. The inn's unique location and storied past have drawn both the curious and the brave to its doors, their interest piqued by the promise of otherworldly encounters. Over the years, the inn has become a touchstone for those captivated by the supernatural. Its rooms and corridors echo with whispers of the past, creating a tapestry of tales that reach out from the shadows and pull us into its chilling narrative. The ancient Ram Inn is more than a building. It's a living, breathing testament to the power of place and the enduring allure of the unknown. It's a place where the veil between the physical and spiritual world is thin, where each creak of the floorboards and rustle of the wind carries the weight of centuries. Little did those laborers know they were building more than just an inn. They were laying the foundation for centuries of chilling tales. Now, let us delve into the dark history of the witch's room. In the depths of the 16th century, a time when shadows of fear and superstition cloaked the hearts of men, the ancient Ram Inn became the refuge for a woman on the run. Accused of witchcraft, a crime that carried the death sentence, she sought sanctuary within the stone walls of the inn. Her hope was to disappear, to meld into the fabric of the inn, and escape the cruel fate that awaited her. However, the woman's desperate bid for freedom was short-lived. Her presence was discovered, and in a chilling act of retribution, she was dragged from her hiding place, tied to a stake, and burned alive. Her screams of protest and pleas for mercy were drowned out by the crackling flames, her life extinguished under the watchful eyes of a society gripped by fear. Yet it is said that death was not the end for this unfortunate soul. Her spirit, wronged and restless, found a way to linger in the place of her last refuge. The witch's room, named in her memory, is now believed to be haunted by her spectral presence. Her desperate cries can still be heard on quiet nights, echoing through the inn's ancient corridors. Visitors have reported feeling an inexplicable chill upon entering the room, a sudden drop in temperature that sends shivers down the spine. Some have felt an unseen hand brush against their skin, while others have seen a spectral figure moving in the shadows. The woman's spirit, it seems, is still seeking justice, still yearning for a peace that was brutally denied to her. This tale of the witch's room is a haunting reminder of a time when fear of the unknown led to unspeakable acts. A time when the innocent were persecuted and their spirits left to wander in eternal unrest. Her spectral presence serves as a chilling reminder of a time when fear and superstition ruled. 
In 1968, a new chapter began with the arrival of John Humphreys. A man of courage and curiosity, Humphreys became the custodian of the ancient Ram Inn, assuming the mantle of its caretaker. But his tenure at the inn was not merely about maintaining its ancient infrastructure. No, Humphreys found himself drawn into the inn's spectral narratives, becoming a pivotal character in its haunted history. A man of reason and logic, Humphreys initially dismissed the tales of the inn's paranormal activity as mere folklore. However, he soon found himself unable to deny the inexplicable incidents that marked his time. Within these hallowed walls, his encounters with the otherworldly were not fleeting impressions or shadows on the walls. They were tangible, physical experiences that shook him to his core. Humphreys reported incidents of being physically pushed by invisible forces, as if some unseen entity was making its presence known. He spoke of objects moving of their own volition, defying the laws of physics and reason. His bedclothes would be pulled away in the dead of night, and he would awaken to find his belongings scattered, as though tossed about by some mischievous spirit. But Humphreys was not one to cower in the face of these spectral encounters. Instead, he recognized the significance of his experiences. Understanding that he was privy to a realm that straddled the borders of the known and the unknown, he made it his mission to document these occurrences, adding his personal accounts to the inn's already rich tapestry of tales. His commitment to preserving these narratives was unyielding, his determination unwavering. He was not just the custodian of the ancient Ram Inn's physical structure, but also the guardian of its spectral lore. His encounters, his experiences, and his narratives made him a key figure in the inn's legacy, his stories adding another layer of depth to its paranormal history. His narratives added a significant volume to the inn's legacy, making him a central figure in its haunted history. Through his encounters, John Humphreys has become more than just a custodian. He has become a part of the inn's timeless tale, his experiences forever etched into the annals of the ancient Ram Inn's eerie past. The Bishop's Room, a place where the temperature drops and dread fills the air. The ancient Ram Inn has become infamous for its paranormal activity, and nowhere is this more palpable than in the Bishop's Room. Visitors stepping into this room have reported sudden temperature drops, an unsettling chill that seeps into your bones, and an overwhelming feeling of dread that sinks into your soul. But it's not just the frigid air and the suffocating fear that have given this room its chilling reputation. The room is said to be haunted by the apparition of a bishop. Witnesses have reported sightings of a spectral figure roving around, his ethereal presence forever bound to this room. The bishop's presence is believed to be tied to the intersecting ley lines beneath the inn, channels of spiritual energy that amplify the paranormal activity within these ancient walls. Yet, the horrors within the bishop's room are not the only ones concealed within the inn. Beneath the staircase of the ancient Ram Inn, a chilling discovery was made. The skeletal remains of children were unearthed, their bones intermingled with broken daggers. This grim find suggested a tale of ritual sacrifice, a dark secret hidden beneath the inn's history. And the echoes of lost innocence do not end there. The attic of the inn is another hotspot of supernatural activity. Here, visitors have reported hearing the haunting cries of a baby, a spectral lullaby that echoes through the night. 
These cries serve as a chilling reminder of the innocent lives that were snuffed out too soon, their spirits forever trapped within the inn's walls. Each account, each sighting, each spine-chilling sound adds another layer to the inn's haunted tapestry. The ancient Ram Inn's tale is one steeped in history, horror, and the unexplained. It's past forever present within its walls. These chilling accounts cast a long, dark shadow over the inn's history. The ancient Ram Inn stands as a testament to the past, a beacon for paranormal enthusiasts, and a chilling reminder of the horrors that can lurk within the walls of history. Among the inn's numerous tales is that of a nightmarish entity, an entity that slinks through the darkened corridors an oppressive presence that preys on the inn's unsuspecting visitors during the cloak of night. This is the tale of the succubus, an entity feared for its unsettling interactions with the living. The succubus is believed to be a malevolent spirit that seeks to drain the energy of those who dare to sleep within the inn's ancient walls. Guests, skeptics, and believers alike have reported waking from terrifying dreams to an overwhelming sense of dread, their breaths caught in their throats as they feel the weight of an unseen presence pressing down upon them. But the ancient Ram Inn isn't merely a collection of chilling tales, it's a living testament to history, its past etched into every stone and beam archaeological findings within the inn have lent a certain credence to the tales that whisper through its halls. Beneath the staircase, the skeletal remains of children were found alongside broken daggers, suggesting a history steeped in ritual sacrifice. The inn's legacy also continues to be explored through ongoing paranormal investigations. These investigations, carried out by professionals and enthusiasts drawn to the inn's reputation, seek to peel back the layers of mystery that shroud the ancient Ram Inn. They venture into the inn armed with equipment designed to capture evidence of the supernatural, their findings adding to the inn's already expansive tapestry of the unexplained. The ancient Ram Inn stands as a beacon, its light drawing in those who are fascinated by the supernatural, by history, and by the unknown. It is a place where the veil between worlds is said to be thin, where the echoes of the past resonate in every room, and where each visitor becomes a part of its enduring legacy. The Inn story, woven through centuries, continues to unfold even today. It beckons to those brave enough to step over its threshold, to tread its ancient floors, and to listen to the whispers of history that echo through its halls. The ancient Ram Inn remains a beacon for those fascinated by the supernatural, a place where the veil between worlds is thin and the past is ever-present.